Hello everybody, I'm going to present you today an LED bulb repair and conversion to a battery. Yeah, we got lights, friends. Yeah! LED bulb powered by batteries, friends. LED bulb powered by batteries. Yeah, pretty bright. No skills required. We have chosen this light bulb because I'm gonna explain you in uh, the future videos why. The most important thing is this one, 250 lumens. All right, so this is a three watt LED, 220 volts. Nothing special, very cheap. This one, it was uh, a pound for all trusty pound shop. But the thing on this is, on this uh, LED bulb, manufacturing process this is very easy it got some parts you know this is plastic and metal but basically inside there is a driver and an LED and depending on how good it is can have a heat sink can have some controllers and so on but first thing to be able to repair this one you have to check the power source and the LED bulbs and for uh, our conversion of today we're gonna open it up this one is very easy you just have to have some pointy thing and go across this one and try to stick it somewhere and open it it's gonna pop out it's got some glue or something similar so that's it all right here you go in the inside this is the led and as you can see inside here Move my finger, come on. It's got a driver. All right, first things first to be able to convert this one on a battery, we have to see how much voltage is needed to drive this LED. So, for this one, we're gonna have uh, to plug this one into the main and measure these two terminals with our multimeter put in the DC section onto 200 over here. So I'm going to pause the video, I'm going to go and measure, and then I'm going to be back, friends. Alright, friends, we are back. We did manage to measure this one. As a safety precaution, be very careful when you're going to touch these wires. And use some sunglasses, because all this dazzling light is going to project to you into your eyes. So, after the measurement, uh, I found that we're going to need 123 volts to... Uh, light this uh, LED bulb So we're gonna make some power source and we're gonna test it. Hello You can use it the stuff inside as a 120 volts power supply and test various devices and so on But for this time being we're gonna just unclip the wires and we're gonna put it to a test here you go folks, after a long process, we did manage to dismantle this LED bulb, it's the same as previous. We have managed because we're gonna hold on to this case. This is the power supply, very minimalistical stuff, but it's got a bridge rectifier. That means any LED bulbs will run on DC power, folks, on battery. So, let's carry on with our thing. All right, for this thing, we're gonna cut these wires because maybe we're gonna use this power supply later on. Never know. All right, friends, we are back. We managed to disorder the power supply of the LED. All right, friends, we did disorder the power supply. We have connected these two wires straight into the bulbs. And now we're gonna improvise some LED bulb power supply, a DC power supply, that's gonna give us 123 volts. So for this project, I'm just gonna use some batteries, 9 volts batteries in series, like so. We're gonna connect them and we will see how we're gonna go from there. All right, so bear with me for a while. All right, friends, we have a bunch of batteries here. 13 of them or so you can count them yourself and this one is gonna give us 106 volts so we're gonna put some alligator clips 
Uh, so this is the minus and this is the plus. Plus should be going to red one because we connect the wires accordingly. And fingers crossed. Whew, let's see. It's going to work. Oh, tiny, tiny light. Why is that? Let's improve them a little bit. Let's go higher then. Bang, bang. Let's try. All right. Oh, let's put some more batteries. Maybe these batteries are well drained because I kind of overuse them for a while. You never know. And let's check now. That's more like it, friends. That's more like it. Yeah. So we do have power. Let's measure now to see exactly what's going to be the voltage here. Also, it's 144. That means we didn't measure the we didn't measure the voltage right. But here you go. It's pretty useful. What's going on? Ah, yeah. There you go. It's pretty useful. The light, as you can see, is very bright, very useful. And we can go hard on this. But instead of this battery, we can make an inverter. So all this stuff is going to be tiny as hell, friends. All right, let's measure some amp draw to see how this one is, is drawing. Let's check it. Very quick for you. All right, so he's drawing two milliamps, 20 milliamps, sorry. Yeah, not bad, not bad at all. Not bad at all, friends. Yeah. Let's see now in kind of darkness. Oh, he's bright as hell, friends. Yeah, he's gonna do the job. Thanks all for watching, friends. Thumbs up and share the video. See you next time. Yeah.